Hi friends, welcome to Opa Studies YouTube channel. This is part 8 in Python playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about data types in Python. So the main agenda is to know about few built-in data types in Python. So what is data type actually? In any programming languages, data types are very in important concept actually. So actually whenever you store any data in any variable, you should define a data type for the data in any programming language. Of course, in Python, you no need to explicitly mention the data type as we have seen in our previous video. So for example, if I navigate to Visual Studio Code, uh, if I really want to uh, create any variable which can store any data, I can simply write the variable name and I can pass a value to it. So this is a integer data type. So this is like integer, integer type. So I haven't decide, defined any data type here, right? Like int space x then equals to one. So it is which, which is not required in Python. This we already know. The moment you assign any value to any variable based upon type of data, the variable will get that particular data type. So you, you one should know what kind of data types we will be having in real time. Yeah, so these data types usually like common in any programming languages. So one should know them. So there are so many types of data types in available actually. Text types means like names, words and all. So they are like string in string data type. str is the syntax for that. Okay, numeric types are like int. Int means this integer numbers. Float means uh, nothing but like, uh, let me open this demo.py file here. I have already typed. You can see here. So this is an integer value. So automatically I, my variable here will get a integer data type. So float means it is like points, decimal, like 20 point five like that. Okay. So the, that float value we are assigning into X variable. So the data type of this particular variable be, will become float. Okay. So complex types, uh, sequence means like a, a multiple values. If you want to store in a single set of data, so you can define them as a list or tuple or range. Okay. The syntax to write them. I have already defined here. See here. I am trying to store a list into this variable. So the data type of this variable will become list here. So here it is tuple under. So this list tuple and also you will see something called dictionary here and set and also you will so boolean everyone will know boolean means true or false either true or false you need to assign some value. So some memory related data types like bytes, byte array. So there are so many types of data types of available in the Python. So these are all the list which I have listed here. Okay. So if you don't know about all these data types, that is fine. In this video, you don't focus much about like what list means, what tuple means, what dictionary means and all. We are going to discuss about these types of data in our upcoming videos. So don't worry about that. So right now, just have an idea. Okay. There are these many types of built-in data types are available in Python. Okay, so these are all the examples like that. If you want to store any list type of data, this is the way you write the code and store it into any variable. So, and of course you already know that if you really want to get any data uh, type of, for example, here, I am assigning one as a value for my variable. So the type of this variable will become integer. So if you really want to know that you should use this type function. We have already discussed that in our past videos, right? So if you do use this type function, that will give you back data type of that particular variable. So let me save these changes and if I run this, it is going to get that for me. Okay. See here, it written integer. So if I store instead of integer any string, maybe like Mahir and if I save these changes and then if I run that python space hello world dot py, so it returns string, right? So how that is happening? Because as we know, like variables will get the data type when you assign a value and these are all the built-in data types available in python okay so hope this given a little bit idea about what is data type and how many types of built-in data types we have in the python world don't worry we are going to discuss about all these data types in detail with each one as a separate video so there you will get more idea about each data type like string list tuple range dictionary everything okay so thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications whenever I add videos. Thank you.